everyone welcome to easy explanation so in today's video i'll be starting with the subject operating system okay so as you can see in the header so this uh, playlist will con uh, contain all the notes of operating system as well as i'll be uploading the videos uh, in any uh, nepal engineering counseling license exam okay so uh, in that playlist i'll be uploading the videos that will include the topic of that same and in operating system notes playlist i'll be uploading the videos related to the notes okay so this topic is useful for both that is operating system general notes as well as nec license exam so today's our subject is operating system and the topic that i'm going to discuss is evolution of operating system okay so as you can see in the diagram this one i have taken from somewhere so as you can see in the diagram the evolution of operating system it started with a serial processing and then it went to simple batch system then multi program batch system and finally time sharing system okay so let's discuss each one of them one by one and this topic sometime they ask this in exam and this is important topic for exam point of view so if you see the first generation of operating system was also called serial processing okay and this was in the year from between 1940 to 1950 so in 1940 is the year when the first electronic computer was developed okay so at that time any computer that computer it didn't have any operating system there were no operating system okay so this computer was created without any operating system at that time the program was written for each task okay so you can imagine the uh, work that has to be done at that time each program was written okay so program was written for each task in absolute machine language that is zeros and one and it was used for solving only simple mathematical calculation so it is obvious if you are going to write any program in machine language you can only perform simple mathematical calculation it's very hard to write all the program and this calculations didn't require an operating system so we can say that the first generation of evolution of operating system it was between 90s 40s sorry 1940s to 1950s and this was called serial processing let's go to second generation so second generation is called simple batch system and this was called the second generation and it was between 1955 to 1965 the second generation represents the first operating system known as gmos and this operating system was developed for ibm computer okay so first operating system it was in second generation and it was developed for ibm computer gmos was based on single stream batch processing system okay so what is single stream batch processing system it means that because it collects all similar job in group or batches okay so they used to collect all the similar kind of job for example mathematical calculation of one type they used to collect in a sim, uh, in a group or batches we can say and then submit the job to the operating system using a punch card to complete all job in the machine okay so they used to submit the jobs using punch card and that contained all the similar kind of jobs operating system is cleaned after completing one job so after completing each job the operating system was cleaned for the next job and then it continues to read and initiate the next job in the punch card still it was a tedious task at that time the machines were very big and not everyone could use them but only the professional operators so you can imagine it was not for laymen it, it was not for common people you can say only the professionals used to use the operating system so next came our third generation so it was multi program batch system okay so new opet it was between it was in between the third generation was in between 1965 to 1980 new operating system that could perform multiple task in a sing in a single computer program was success for these generations so you can see in second generation what was it single one time one work was done okay but here we can perform multiple tasks so this was the success of this generation and the concept of multi programming came from here that is performing multiple program multiple task in a single time another progress which led to the development of personal computer in fourth generation is the new development of mini computer with dc pdp1 okay so this era we got our new personal computer so new generation was developed and finally the fourth generation which was the fourth generation computer which was also called time sharing system it was between 1980s and till now we can say 
okay so development of personal computer represent the fourth computer the cost of personal computer was high back then okay so the computer that we are using now we can say it uses fourth generation operating system it was very costly we can also imagine buying a laptop a uh, few days a few years ago and then buy the same laptop now so according to the os according to the uh, systems the price changes microsoft and the windows operating system were related to creating personal computer okay i think all of you know about this microsoft and windows os some of the popular operating system are microsoft windows mac os and linux the linux operating system was created in early 1990s and the first window operating system was created by microsoft in 1975 so if possible please remember the dates for the mcq question if you are preparing for license exam please prepare okay i'll be telling this now so windows released os such as window 95 window 98 windows xp and most window user use the windows 10 operating system apple released another popular operating system developed in 1980s which is named as macintosh os or mac os okay so these all things we know now this is for the theory question so if in general os exam if they ask you write about the evolution of operating system or the generation of operating system same thing will go same topic will go and if you are preparing for license exam please uh, write this uh, dates and all okay like in which first generation date was like from 1940 to 1950 second generation date then third generation date and in which generation this punch card were used we can say it in the second generation in which generation the task was submitted in batches in second generation okay so this type of question can be asked in mcq type next is uh, example of uh, third generation computer they can say in fourth generation you can remember the dates and the types of os okay so after completing the playlist i'll also be covering the mcq questions okay so till then stay safe and thank you